Hi, this is Dr. Ivan Meisner with IvanMeisner.com. And today, I want to talk about last year. I don't usually start uh, a, a new year talking about the previous year, but I think uh, 2020 deserves a, a little more conversation. I ended the year with a humorous graphic on my social media that said this. It said, Dear 2021, I don't want any trouble from you. Just come in, sit in the corner, don't touch anything, and keep your mouth shut. Now, although it was pithy and pretty funny, there's an important flip side to this sentiment, sentiment. And that flip side begs the question, what did we personally learn from 2020? I think that question's important to consider. You see, complaining about things that go horribly wrong is easy, but finding the positive in difficult situations is not. I learned a great deal from 2020 that have become valuable takeaways for me. These are some of them. I hope you have some. First, microdose the news. I learned to get what I need from news apps and not to obsess over watching the news hour after hour. Negative news sells and the media has become a master of sharing negative news. Technically now it's mostly opinions rather than actual news. Another valuable lesson I learned was from a man who had to work from home and he had to watch his children and uh, supervise them where they were in school and he said that was really stressing him out. And we spoke about that and after the conversation, he realized that this was actually an opportunity to get closer to his kids, that years from now, the kids might actually look back with fond memories of this, and he may too. It completely changed his position and in, in his mindset uh, during that time. I once again witnessed people who were focused beating out fear during challenging times. When people are frozen in fear, there's no hope, but when that fear focuses them, they have hope. Hope. Hope is more powerful than fear. Hope is that little voice inside you whispering to you about what can be when everyone around you is screaming about what can't be. Hope plus a plan plus action will lead you through difficult times. I learned that during difficult times, you need your network more than ever. I saw people support each other emotionally and professionally. I witnessed people give one another ideas that help keep their business alive. One example is the furniture reupholstery shop that became a COVID mask manufacturing company. And then another is the brewery that became a COVID hand sanitizer company. I learned that if you wait until tough times are over, your business will be over. During difficult times, you need your network, like I said, more than ever. Social distancing is the wrong attitude. It's physical distancing that's critical. We need to be more social than ever. I learned that I could travel the world without getting on a plane. I have 2.3 million miles on American Airlines alone. It was a gift to be able to spend months with my wife at home. It was the longest period of time we had together in our 31 years of marriage without me getting on a plane, and I will forever be thankful for that. Lastly, I learned the friends are more important than ever. The quality that the people in your life or in your room, as I call it in one of my books, the quality of the people in your life determine the quality of your life. For me, that last lesson was profound. It was a yuff, tough, really tough year for me, as it was for many people. I come out of 2020 with a clear vision of who my friends are and who really cares about me as a person. I will forever be grateful for that. So I suggest that you not completely write off 2020 as it might be easy to do and erase it from your memory banks. Instead, consider what you learned from last year and what your positive takeaways are from that experience. You will be a better person for it. I would love to hear one or more of your takeaways from 2020. What was something positive that you learned or took away from the most challenging year in recent history? Share it with me in the comments below. This is Ivan Meisner, founder of BNI with IvanMeisner.com. Thanks for watching.